They're on to us. Yep. Damn it. I think you should have been more careful. Get back on the damn road. Yeah, sorry. Must have left the dress room. Slow it down a bit. So what were you able to lift from the house? A few bits and pieces. None too fancy. Well, we need anything we can get right now. Yeah. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. Why oh, aren't we on the damn road? Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn there. Hello, Seamus. We met you. Use the reins, damn it. How was Fine. it? Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. Putain, je deviens riche ici. C'est total des ajouts de MED. Good morning, Arthur. Not a bad day for it. Dear Arthur, 
I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some mm. bad luck, and, well, it's a long story and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again, if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. <laughs> Arthur. Dutch? Miss O'Shea? Well, feels like we are finally getting back on our feet. You, uh, find a buyer for them bonds we stole? Not yet, but Jose is working on it. When we heading west? Soon? I don't know. Feels like things have changed. The whole world's changed. They don't want folk like us no more. We're being hunted. We are smarter than them. Only the feeblest of men take jobs in the government. <laughs> I hope so. Trust Dutch, Mr. Morgan. You have to. They got Micah! Dutch! Arthur! <clears throat> What's going on? They got Micah. He, he's he been arrested for murder. He was in Strawberry It's okay, and... son. Breathe. <sighs> they nearly lynched me. They, they got Micah and the sheriffs in Strawberry. And there's talk of hanging them. Here's open. Arthur. What? The fool brought this on himself. You know my feelings about him, Dutch. You think I can't see past his bluster to the heart inside? He is a fine man. No. I ain't saving that fool. I can't go. My face will be all over West Elizabeth. I am asking. He would do it for you. I don't think he would, but fine, all right. Arthur. You okay, Lenny? Yeah, of course I'm okay. You don't seem okay. You take that kid into town. Valentine, not Strawberry. Get him drunk. And Arthur, no crazy business. I've given that up. And you get Micah out of that jail. Come on, son. I'll get to it, Dutch. Just can't drop everything. I rode as fast as I could. Didn't stop for nothing. Yeah, you look like you've been through it. I'm beat. We finally get off that mountain, then this. Mike has got a crazy side off. What were you boys doing? You were supposed to be scouting ahead for us. I kept asking him what we was doing, but he was, you worry too much, kid. Just some business to attend to, kid. You know how he is. Yes, I do. He was half soaked before we even got there. Then we ran into some fellas. One of them Mike knew. Drink some more. And this is supposed to be a dry town we're in, too. And then he shoots one of them. I know how that goes. Couldn't even tell you quite how. Happened like the strike of a match. The law was on us fast, too. They was ready to strangle me up there and then. But I got away, just about. You're all right now. We'll take care of it. So you're gonna go get him? I'll come with you. No, you leave it to me. For now, let's drink some. Forget about Mike. It was drank that started all this. Here we are.
Just one or two. Right, Alpha? Of course, just a drink. No big drum. Can we get a couple beers, please? You, I don't want no trouble. You'll get none from me. I was defending myself. Tommy, he's... He'll be fine. Here, have one for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Micah seemed to know a lot of people. That was the problem. How you mean? I mean, I done seen a lot of crazy, crazy a stuff, but Mike. A lot of crazy, crazy stuff. Will you shut up? Will you shut up? Be quiet, buddy. <laughs> oh, there, Dullard. My lord. You men is dull. <laughs> hey, leave this fool alone. Leave the fool alone. People have been leaving me alone for the last 10 years. I'm bored with being left alone. Hey, buddy, if you don't shut up, I'm gonna rip your head clean off your shoulders. Is that clear? Get out of here! Clear? Clear? Very clear. I'm on my way. <laughs> oh. Mm. Oh. <laughs> That's great, partner. <laughs> Lenny, Lenny, where are you? Hey, Lenny! Lenny? Seen that feller I was with? Wouldn't know. Lenny, where are you? You know which way my friend went? Don't ask me. I'm my friend, you know where it went? Hello, Arthur. <laughs> you know what? I don't know. <laughs> 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 Talking to nobody. What did you say? What? I said, what did you say? Get lost, buddy. Shut up, mister. Yeah, shut your mouth, mister. <rire> Il a vu un monstre. Oh, ah, ce n'est pas lui Merde. Lenny! Fast! 
bastard! Ah mais c'est des Lenny partout. Lenny, où are you hiding now? Lenny, my boy. I'm Clyde. You got the wrong fellow. Yeah. Il disait lui ressemble. <laughs> Found you, Lenny. <laughs> Lenny, what are you talking about? Damn it, Lenny, stop slumping off on me! Just go home, will you? There you are, Lenny. What? Hi, Lenny. Arthur, Arthur what are you doing? <laughs> Tiens, ça le fait. Oh, ta mère, ouais. Tu es un bon ami de moi, Arthur. Chut. Cheers. Cheers. Tu es cool, hein? Oh, the Oh, man, cool, cool, cool. You stop right now, you drunken fool. I said, stop. I'm an American. Bala, go, Javier. You alive? Arthur. You alive, Arthur? Uh, I want to die. God damn. Where are we? What did we do? I don't know. Oh, me neither. Uh, yeah. You pair degenerates. Uh, There's a fine for drunken violence in this town. You're just lucky no one was killed. Hey, we didn't start a thing. <laughs> yes, you did. Well, I don't remember. Either you fools got any money, it's ten dollars and you're free to walk. Sure. Now, get out of here. I don't want to see either you around here no more. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> so, that was a quiet drink? First one was pretty quiet. <laughs> yeah, the first one was pretty quiet. At least it took your mind off goddamn Mikey. Well, that's certainly true. I gotta get out of here. I'm just gonna... Have a little sit down. Feel sorry for myself. Wesh, toujours plus loin les quêtes. Allez, allons libérer. Here, there's a pack of savages all 
Bon, je vais à mon noyau. Ouais bon on verra hein. Hello. Bon, En vrai je vais, je vais prendre des trucs que j'ai besoin oh, C'est bien ça Seems everyone with a rifle been hunting these of late. Anyway. Anyhow. Okay then. Like a hole in the head. A lot of folk coming by with these lately. Thanks for your help. Appreciate you stepping in there. Those bastards been turning the screw on me from day one, saying I gotta pay them protection money. 
I told him where to stick it, and well, I guess you just saw how that panned out. Ils sont peut-être une.
bring him. Hello, sir. I've uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang, Tom O'Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight. Two men got killed. Now one of them's an idiot. The other's some kind of dumb mix. So maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Thank you, Charles. Don't pas. Let me out of here, you maggots! Arthur! Arthur! Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you going to get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. Well, you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. Got any dynamite? You might want to step back a bit. This wall just needs some good forcing. Yes. Hook that over the bars. See if you can pull them off. Non, non, je préfère la dynamite. What a modern oh. disaster this is gonna be. Just pull that lever. Come on. Get out of here, come on. What the oh. hell are you doing? He wasn't O'Driscoll. I knew you were strong the moment I laid eyes on you. Come down, folks. Get up from that. Come on, Arthur. Carry me over here. Let's get the hell out of here. I got some unfinished business. Trust me, Morgan. Trust you? You have finally lost your damn mind. Moving up. Mais quel trou de balle aussi, mais comment il fait pour mourir ce trou de balle de mort Don't go that way, let's get the hell out of here I got some unfinished business, trust me Morgan Trust you You have finally lost your damn mind Keep moving Arthur God You goddamn maniac I should have left you to hang. 
Woman, like I said, I need to see someone. Where are you? Get out here! Oh, I'm gonna get to you. Let's get it! Ah! It ain't skinny, Micah. It's Norman. Oh. Oh. You always was a letdown, you fat sack of crap. Oh. Excuse me, man. C'est un malade. They had something of mine. My guns. I'm doing the world a favor here. Come on, this way. Yeah? Who wants to see me hang now? See the horses? Come on. Follow me. Let's go. I reckon it's time we got out of here, Morgan. Now you want to get out of here. is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. I saw how it goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you owe Lenny too. If he hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely. I promise. Yeah, well, you're lucky Dutch has got your back. Someone I think we finally lost him. Well, I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was, having a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Uh, Real funny. <clears throat> why you act all sour all yeah, the time. Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court jester? All right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me, sons of Dutch, makes us brothers. Sometimes brothers make mistakes. I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back at Strawberry. Come see me. 
Maybe I can make things up to you. So you ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <laughs> Bye now. Yeah. Ah, j'ai gagné un Glock. Mal. It's okay, girl. <laughs> Voilà. Fin de session.